<laughs> Is there anything that I'd like to share? Uh, my name is Ang Hui Lin and I'm from the class of 2019. So I do music. I love learning to make music because it is a method for me to kind of face my own demons and to improve myself. I mean like learning how to deal with my own anxiety, maybe a little bit of you know insecurity, actually quite a lot of insecurity about like myself and my general like lack of self-confidence, you know, over the course of like the maybe two and a half years that I've been doing music. So it's been things like meeting new friends, you know, because I'm actually normally quite afraid of strangers. <laughs> While I'm probably most comfortable with the act of singing in itself. I also like to look at like music production when I'm not doing live performances, which is actually not very often. I do music on the side at home, like I will record a vocal track, I'll record a acoustic guitar track, and then I'll try to like beef that up with things like software instrument drums, synthesizers, violins, piano, that, that sort of thing. Like not trained at all, so it's just like experimentation. I fell like very, very much in love with a bunch of really great Japanese bands. Um, I started with 1OK Rock and Red Rims and then I moved on to bands like Hello Sleepwalkers, Lap and Terran, a little bit of Stereodive Foundation and I've also I've also re like really really liked Galileo Galilei. I like this so much I spent like a bunch of money on like a t-shirt and a bag. It's bad. I was like this is bad. <laughs> Wow, it's just like changed the way that I've seen the world. So I chose to audition in under theatre, because, not because I was like, oh my god, I have to be a theatre person, or, you know, oh my god, my mom's a theatre, I gotta do theatre. The difference with Sota was that because, you know, everyone was a little bit out of their depth, nobody really knew what was going on, um, I think everybody just made an effort to try. I, I didn't actually have a lot of friends in primary school. Um, not anyone's fault. That's just the way it was. And because of that, like, I find that the, the connections that, that I made with people, the friends that I made, even if I'm not friends with them now, they meant something. I learned things from them. And I don't think I can say that I had that same experience when I was, like, 12 years old. I mean, like, granted I was 12, but still. There are some people who have been friends with people since they were, like, what, three or four? And they're still going strong, which is, like, amazing. I don't know how they do it. Being in Sota makes you want to learn. Not because you think that you need to ace an exam, I mean like, you do, but besides that, aside from that, you want to learn because learning is fun, and why not? It's also like a promo video for Sota now, but... Um, do I feel Singaporean? That's a darn good question. I actually don't know. Because I've been, I mean like, this has been something that my friends and I talked, about, talked a lot about in the last couple of years, but... Um, the issue of being Singaporean, right, or what Singaporean identity is. Some people would argue that we don't have one. I'm of the opinion that we do have one. I, I don't think I've been in any other place long enough to, you know, grow my roots out, right? At this point in time, I've not had the chance to uproot, so my roots are still here. I first, okay, I first colored my hair when I was 15, and that was like one inch. I just got one inch and I spent like the whole year trying to convince my mom to let me do it. The only reason why I wanted to do it was because my friend at the time, she is my cousin's cousin on the other side. She had like colored hair because she was in LaSalle and she was really cool. And I was like, oh man, I want to do that too. So um, I asked my mom and I, I like, mom, let me do it, let me do it. And she was like, okay. I went um, after Midnight Blue by Manic Panic. I liked it because, you know, it was my favourite colour. Faded to a pastel green and I got in trouble in school for not cutting it off by the first week. 